Hey guys, welcome back to coding video. This is a small, interesting video for you guys, where I'm going to ask you a question. I'm going to write some code right here, okay? And then I'm, I'm going to want you to guess what the output is. We're going to kind of play guessing game this time. So I'm going to write the code, pause the video, you guys, and see if you can get it right. So here's the code, you know, right here. All right, here we go. I'm going to say int a equals 10, <coughs> and then double b equals... 10.7 and then double C equals A plus B uh, into D equals A plus C and then system dot out dot print okay. C plus space here plus D all right y'all so here is the code. You guys can read this code, trace through it, pause the video if you need extra time, and guess what the output is gonna be. That's not my guess, you know. Um, but I want you guys to make a guess as well. Here's this code, A equals 10, B, B is a double, 10.7. C is also a double, is equal to A plus B, and D is an integer type, is equal to A plus C. The system not out there print line C space D. Here we go, you guys. I'm going to execute it. Pause the video if you still have made a guess yet. You get <coughs> Incompa uh, incompatible type possible lossy conversion from double to an int. So basically, if that's what you thought was going to happen, you would be correct. So normally you trace through this code, right? Okay, so I think, oh, I don't know, C equals A plus B, 20.7. A, D equals A plus C plus 20.7 plus 10, that's 30.7, but it's integer, so it rounds down to 30. So it's 20.7 and 30. Some of you guys may have thought along the lines of that, but here's the thing. In D equals A plus C. The problem is, though, is we're doing conversion, right? See, look, double C is fine, 20.7, that's a double, because it's a, you can hold decimal places, but integers can't, right? Um, because this is a double, right? Uh, 30.7, right? That's what D is, right? It's 20.7 plus 10, right? This 10 is fine, but this is a double. We can't do A plus C. We have to convert this to an integer. So we're going to get the integer value of A plus C. So let's try that. Now we get 20.7 and 30. So remember, without this integer part right here, it won't work, all right? You're gonna need that. So hopefully, this video was a kind of fun little interactive video for you guys and hopefully yeah, you guys know that integers are 32 bits a double to 64 and you can't store a double as an integer thank you all for watching